Hi there everyone and welcome to episode 83 of Universe Mode where we are starting off with the greatest women's wrestler of all time <laughs> in Eva Marie. And I have a feeling she's been sacrificed here tonight. Sacrificed? Yes, because somebody is returning. Let's find out who that somebody is. Becky is back. She is, after being sidelined forever. And this is what I meant. You've given her a duff match here so she'll get a oh, cheap victory. <clears throat> Didn't put up against anyone difficult. <laughs> up against 67 rated Eva Marie. Well, you know, you got to do what you got to do. So, legs all fixed up and healed. Looking to try and get herself back in title contention. She must beat Eva Marie here first. Right, so I'm Eva Marie. I am Becky Lynch. And I believe we've got a big tweet, haven't we? We have, from WWE themselves. Okay. Jericho is not <laughs> the GM of SmackDown, <laughs> and his actions were not official. So he just literally walked out with a mic and said... Basically, yes. We had a match, though, Joe <laughs> versus Rollins. There were Samoa Joe will still have a title shot in the future. Right, okay. And so the two-minute match gets wiped. Yep. What about Dean Ambrose at the end of it? It was... Contracted by Chris Jericho. That not so happening. Chris Jericho signed Dean Ambrose to SmackDown yep. whilst Chris Jericho thought he was GM That's by yep. making himself GM. That's yeah, that, that none of that was official. Basically. Well, I'm gonna be uh, reprimanding Dean Ambrose. Joe's there. still got his uh, Dean Ambrose signing a SmackDown contract without authorization from Edge. I'm gonna be too happy about that. That's jo unbelievable. Joe's still got his shot, and Rusev has got the month off due to his injury. What? So, Seth Rollins. neither of them are facing him at the pay-per-view. But Seth Rollins just defeated Samoa Joe in two He will weeks. get his shot, but not at the pay-per-view. Hmm. So Rusev has got off lucky there. He, well, he Seth did Rollins put up a, a hellacious fight against Apollo. Took a monitor where the sun do not shine. So, I mean... I'm going to get in touch with Edge about that one. Yeah, I'd be uh, sorting out now? Dean Ambrose if I were you. Yeah, a couple of things to saw out there for the Radar Superstar. So Chris Jericho was a fake GM all along, <laughs> and you've still got somebody to find You've them. still got to find someone, yeah. I'm guessing his thinking was, I won the Battle Royal, I'm the team captain, I'm also the captain of SmackDown. <laughs> Chris Jericho doing what he does best, scheming. I love how, even though he was GM, he didn't put himself in a title match. <laughs> Let's try to act official on his first day. <laughs> Unbelievable. So all that in the last episode getting wiped. What well, a victory no. for Seth Rollins. And it doesn't technically even count. Because Samoa Joe still gets a shot. Fucking <laughs> Jericho, what do you expect? Ooh, what's this? Oh, nice. Working on the arm. We will see Braun versus Ric Flair at the pay-per-view. Oh, right, okay. That's going to happen. That's a pre-show match. Crazy. It's going to end quickly, that one. That's why. No yeah. need to put that on the pay-per-view. Ric Flair's no already defeated... quickly. He's already defeated Braun in about three minutes before. Yeah, and then Braun absolutely battered him backstage. Yeah, sneak attack. This is a bit embarrassing, isn't it, for Becky Lynch? Oh, my God! <laughs> that Boo all you want, people. Eva Marie's going for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Gonna take out Nia Jax. That's a former team, isn't it? Oh no! Here we it's go! Done. Oh no no no! Oh, there very is. nice. Just reach your arm out. Just reach your arm out, Eva Marie. Why is that so easy for <laughs> Why you? Why is this so easy? No! God damn it! They're not even in red. They're in orange. Really? Yeah. She's back. She's back. Her submission defense must be dire. Oh my god, I that see was... what you've done there. You've picked somebody who can't defend himself. <laughs> <laughs> well, I actually thought she might be able to. I, uh, to be fair, I almost hit the finish. <laughs> Just put your arm out, get the rope. <laughs> she doesn't have that ring awareness. So. There Back you go. Called it at the start. Called it at the start. As long as you don't face Charlotte again, we're good. Just going to give her easy matches. It's like Rocky Balboa in the, the third Rocky film. He just goes up against 10 bums and then he has to face Mr. T in the end, club a lang. And uh, it's exactly what Mickey says to him. This, yeah. In fact, she is called Becky Balboa. There this is go. Rocky Free. <laughs> this is what we've just and done. Nia Jax is going to be club a lang. Plagiarised Rocky. <laughs> Excellent. 
Right then, hopefully what we're about to see will last longer than even Marie and Becky Lynch. Yep. Johnny Gargano. The reasoning behind this, we've got a tweet again from okay. Billy Ray. Here we go. Cesaro was blatantly seen entering the locker room just after Gargano. Yep, told you that. We know it was you attacked him. Yep, I exactly. Didn't, I didn't believe this. I didn't Cesaro know, now I've seen official told proof. You. Now I've seen official proof. Clear evidence. I believe it. So if you don't know what happened, it was DIY versus John Cena and Cesaro at Survivor Series, and it was meant to be the semi-final of the Dusty Tag Team Classic. Cesaro injures Gargano. Play a replay of it whilst I'm talking. And uh, all what we saw was Cesaro go backstage into the locker room as Gargano, and then, mysteriously, Gargano gets injured and can't compete, which gives Cena and Cesaro an automatic bye to the final, and then they beat Revival and win the whole damn thing. So these two have now got a championship match at TLC versus Itami and Breeze, and they've gone to another level with that. Behold the future of the tag team division. There's no way they're losing. Look at But them. I think if Gargano can defeat Cesaro here tonight for his revenge, I think DIY will get a future shot. Yes. Okay. I'll Depending on I'll whoever wins stick, I mean, against Hideo and Breeze versus these two yeah, at but TLC. Let's face it. Look who it is. The Superman. Mm, we'll see. Johnny Wrestling might have something up his sleeve. Just look at the damage Cesaro did to Johnny Wrestling there. What did he actually do to him? Supposedly, he threw him so hard into a wall that at the same time, his arm hit the wall and his head. So that's why he's got that kind of semi-cast on his arm. And also he's wearing protective headgear. Thanks, Cesaro. How hard Thanks, did he Cesaro. throw him? He must have done the swing. Well, when you're not expecting it, you can't prepare for it, can you? So, I suppose not. I'm glad though, justice has finally been found. Though. I told you this at the start. Yeah. Like, oh, no, no, revival. Been on the blame on a raw team out of nowhere. You say it was. Uh... Well, yeah, but revival has been fishy backstage, so you know. Hmm. Here we go. Right. So now he's going to get his comeuppance in this match now. There's always John Cena riding around. No! He's a time lord after all. No, I don't even think he should be out here, to be honest. Well, that's, that's what you just said. To. Justice has been served, but... <laughs> is this a good idea? That's reminiscent of him throwing him against the wall. He's grabbing his head. This is also reminiscent of him throwing him against the wall. Oh, we don't want to receive an uppercut. <laughs> that was so robotic. He put his hands out, then his fingers closed, and then he went pap out. No proper smug about it as well. Here we go. Gargano fighting for a chance here to get DIY in the tag team title contention. No! <laughs> Don't you dare! Oh! You might have a finisher as well! Oh my word. It's all gone wrong for Cesaro. Big super kick there. What have we got? We've got a signature. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Huh? To the corner you go. Lawn dart it. No! It's not safe, this move. It's not safe. Neither was attacking God. Gargano backstage. But that didn't stop Cesaro, did it? Good God. Look at how proud Champer is at the minute. Oh! oh, oh. And it's all over for the Super 1. Oh, oh fired it. Got it. I swear that was a free. Oh. oh, no. He went back the other way. Turned into it. <laughs> Zara with a big chance now to get back into it. Oh, no. Not towards John. Stay out with this, John. It's between these two. Although I'm sure John Cena was very proud of what Cesaro did. Very proud of him. Pacing? Mm. Oh yeah. Reminiscent of what happened oh, backstage. No. Oh. I bet that's what happened, you know. And it might have been. Yeah, that would have worked. Head and arm at the same time getting injured. Just reminding him of it. Mm. Thanks for being a good partner, John. Confident in Cesaro's abilities. Constantly working on the head of Donny Gargano. Don't wear a stupid hat then. That's proof of protection, blooming heck. He's not wearing it for fashion reasons. 
Working the waist oh, now. There is a second one there. I wanted to see actually what it looked like, that second reversal from that position. Oh, yeah. Doesn't be, you'll get a chance. But not today. Today you lose. The actual best chance for DIY here is Johnny gets the victory here. The super dudes defeat Itami That's not the official and Breeze. Team, <laughs> and then DIY can defeat these two and get the tag team title from them. That's the perfect arc for I think those two old scrubs could beat John Cena and Cesaro. We'll see. Cesaro swing. Not a pin Already of received one. Gargano up against the barricade. Getting thrown into it. And ready by Cesaro. Champa's got a problem with me. Champa actually wanted to fight in this. He actually wanted to fight Cesaro, but uh, <laughs> just put his hand on his shoulder. <laughs> but Gargano went, nope. This is my fight. I'm the one who's going to annihilate Cesaro. You're doing a good job of it. Don't speak too soon. Referee. Referee's well it. stuck. I think the referee's actually uh, inhuman. <laughs> he took a Brock Lesnar punch and he shrugged it off. Okay. Oh, oh ran into this that. is it. This is the mad comeback. Uh, top rope. Avoid Cena and Cesaro. Or maybe get them both. Maybe get them both. Oh, yeah. oh no! <laughs> yes! That's so super after all. And it's Skittles. Cena's going to be oh, pissed. John! <laughs> oh no, what's happened to Johnny? Have you, got, you have got like... Oh, he's over there. You are kind of... <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> No, 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 you fool! Oh, just saved you. Why do they all have to scream the name when they do moves? <laughs> Always looking at John Cena. Oh no, no! Oh, signature! Boom! Ooh, super kick right in the chin. Yeah. Obviously. <laughs> what else would you do with switching music? <laughs> so desperate. They're coming God. again! <laughs> no, God! <laughs> Are we going to be in a vicious loop of Cena getting you up and I can suicide now? <laughs> Groundhog Day. <laughs> God damn it. Leave me down, John Cena. <laughs> no! 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 Here we go again. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my god. He keeps giving you what you... He's not working! Stop! He's not doing it now. Oh, for God's oh, sake. Oh, he's learned. He's learned. Oh my word, that was funny. Acting like the two idiots that they are. Oh! Oh no! No! All good things must end. <laughs> oh, we are now. No, not again! Again! Uppercut and then swing! And it's right into the injured arm, by the way. It's actually on that side. It's definitely what happened in the locker room. Don't need the can on this little scrub. Oh. Whoa! Whoa calm it! <laughs> yeah, I went into an infinite loop then, like Doctor Strange. Oh, oh, I thought he'd reversed it away with once again reacting. It's dark red, Gargano said. I mean, what did you expect coming in with a stupid Oh Oh my word Atom Face first Oh dear. Not only that stupid. It, it look For at protection it. reasons, I don't know what I said. I don't care, I'm gonna okay. make you tap though whilst you're looking at me in confusion. <laughs> God, is that I'm pressing circle! Oh I'm square! Oh it doesn't matter! It doesn't oh. matter! Oh! Oh, oh no! <laughs> you should be so ashamed! 
Have you lost that match? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so now, Super Cena and Cesaro go on to face Hideo and Breeze, and whoever wins that match, DIY is coming from, and that should be the perfect time for Gargano to recuperate and uh, rest up and get back to 100%. Uh, wow. Is John Cena the one that carries the team? Hmm. I know he was carrying Cesaro for the majority of that game. That's probably what it was. was. That's stupid. Repeatedly. He was like, let me rest, John. Constant cheap No, get shots. back up. I was like, constant cheap shots from you. John Cena was setting him up for me. And then like a thief, he stole my finisher. God damn it. God damn it. A lot of the moves there from Gargano to Cesaro were assisted by John Cena then. Look at that. He had to tap. No other option. Look at that. Go on, you know you have to, there we go. Cena is not impressed. He'll be saving that one. I can't believe it. Well, I'm sorry Hideo and Breeze because these two are going to be furious going into that match right now. Did you see Cena? He was screaming at someone in front row. <laughs> Johnny Gargano gets his revenge on Cesaro. But Super Cena and Cesaro do get their tag team match for winning the Dusty Tag Team Classic at TLC for the championships versus Breeze and Tammy. But for now, that is the end of episode 83.